Hi guys, welcome to my fall 2020 home tour. So first we're gonna start out outside. These are real pumpkins that I stacked up just so, and they are from Walmart. Um, I think they were about $13 for all three of them. So such a great deal. Um, over here I have a little um, tea light, but I don't have my tea light in there yet. A little candle. Um, I have some mums. These are still, this one needs to bloom and that one needs to halfway bloom. Um, but I bought them that way because last year they died early. And then I have a few pumpkins. They are from Walmart and also um, Michael's. And then I have a little birdhouse here and that is also from Michael's. And then the hay bale is from Target. Sweep out here. My little rug is from um, Target this year. It was only $12.99. And then my wreath on my door is Hearth and Hand. And I have had that since summertime. Um, I think they still have it. And then the welcome sign in the middle, that is from Walmart this year. And it was only a few dollars. And then this welcome sign, I have had it for quite some time now with the leaves on it and that is from Michael's. So I'll stand back and let you guys see. So my front porch is small but we like to make it cozy for each season. And then let's go inside. This is what you see when you enter in my home. So it's our dining area but on this side we have a little entryway set up. So sorry for the lighting guys. I have this um, piece of artwork that I had from Michaels from years and years ago. I have these hooks. I will have them linked down below. Those are from Amazon and the lighting is. Um, I have that hat, which is also from Amazon. I, that's one of my favorite fall hats and I love wearing it. I have these florals from walmart.com and I got those this year. This little flowers and garden tin I got from Michael's during um, their summer sale. And then on the bottom here, I have these boots that I got on major sale from Michael's. Some florals in there. So the green florals are from Michael's during the summertime on major sale. And then the um, little sprigs to make it a little bit, look a little bit more fall-ish. Those are from Walmart this year. And then a basket, that basket is from Michaels, I wanna say, and that's for our guests to put their shoes. Then we have this bench from Tractor Supply, and I got it in the summertime. That pillow is from Michaels, and then this blanket is from Target. And then I have a little bird's cage there. Um, during the summertime, those cages were on a major sale. I'm trying to move so you guys can see really good. And then I have some velvet pumpkins in there. So the bird cages are for Michaels. The velvet pumpkins are for my local grocery store. I have this greenery here from Hobby Lobby. Um, I got it during the summertime when we actually had a major sale because those can be kind of expensive. And then this lantern, which I absolutely am obsessed with. That was one of my birthday presents. It's super chippy. And that is from um, Hobby Lobby. It was around $55, and that was the half off price. So that is a little entryway set up for guests to take off their shoes. And I am looking for a little poof for that area still. And then we're gonna go this way, and this is my entryway table. And I have a little pillow here from Home Goods. I have a throw blanket from Target Dollar Spot a few years ago, and then that basket is from Michael's a few years ago. And then my entryway table is a Hobby Lobby find. Let's turn on this. <laughs> Um, my wax warmer is from Hobby Lobby, and that's kind of a neutral piece. I always have it out here. And um, we'll work from the top down. The mirror, it was a gift from my mother-in-law. 
the um, reef was from Hobby Lobby a few years ago. I love Lamb's ear. And then I just changed out, most of the stuff is stuff that's always here, but I just changed out the florals so they're more fall-like and those are from Walmart. Um, that's our little key holder that's from the Target Dollar Spot a few years back. Um, I added in this Give Thanks sign and that was from, I wanna say Hobby Lobby last year. And then here I just have some staple pieces. Um, those little houses that are so popular that are from um, Walmart, not Walmart, the little houses that are from um, Target Dollar Spot. I've had those for years. And then I have a few pumpkins here. A few pumpkins. And then another velvet pumpkin for my local grocery store. And then a little um, apple crate, and that is from Walmart. And then on the bottom, I have a pillow from um, Hobby Lobby, and then some velvet pumpkins from the Target Dollar Spot, and then another little house, and a greenery piece from Target. And the house is a few, I think, last year, and the greenery piece is from the summer. So that is my little setup. There. So we have white pumpkins, and those are from, I think, my local grocery store last year. And then we have the burnt um, orange pumpkins. Those are from my local grocery store this year. And then the wicker pumpkins are from Target this year. And the greenery is actually from Walmart this year, the lamb's ear, which is the same like my wreath. And I love lamb's ear. And then I always keep these wreaths on the back of my chair and my table. My husband made it, table, bench, the whole shebang. And then my table setting, we have these little, the wicker underneath. That is from um, Home Goods this year, a pack of four for like five bucks. And then on top, that is a little charger from Wayfair, a plate from Macy's, napkin from um, Hearth and Hand Collection on Target, and a little orange pumpkin from um, the Dollar Tree. And I love my table set up. And then in our little hutch here, family pictures on the side, I have um, this little weighted scale, and that is actually from Kirkland's. Um, the R is from Summertime in, at Michael's. The little pots are from Michael's as well during their summer sale, so I got them for next or not, nothing. The moss balls are also from Michael's. I, I just use those throughout. That's kind of like my neutral decor. And then I just stuck some Walmart pumpkins up there, and I got a whole bag of Walmart pumpkins for like three bucks. And then in our hutch, most of the items always stay there. We always keep the family pictures, but I did add one of those velvet pumpkins. And then I all also added this sign that says, hello pumpkin. And then that's it. All of the other items stay there. And I just added two. Kitchen. So up here, the charger that I'm sitting down, that was from Target. This candle, which smells glorious, is from Hobby Lobby this year. And then that's a real plant there that we always have. And if you hear rain in the back, that is, you'll see what it's coming from just a little bit. And then the kitchen, I just added this, um, Tea towel, and that is from Home Goods this year. It came in a pack of two. We have some pumpkins back there. I have some juniper, is my fall scent, and this smells glorious from the um, Hearth Magnolia Home Collection from Target. That's their little home scent. Um, they didn't have hand soap, but we have our sweet orange hand soap, and those are from Amazon. And then I just have a little pumpkin there and that's a real fern 
this area, the family sign I've had forever for Michaels, so it, I've had that twig wreath forever for Michaels as well. I just added in these little burlap pumpkins, and those are from the Target, that night Target. The Dollar Tree, two, three years ago, I added a white pumpkin from Hobby Lobby, and then that house, that is from Hobby Lobby as well. And then this area, we have um, like our little station. I have a huge blue pumpkin, and that is from Home Goods this year. I have some pumpkins that I painted, um, and that both they were white from Walmart, and I just painted them. And then um, that little pumpkin is also that little pumpkin is from Hobby Lobby. And it came in a pack of four. And then there is a pumpkin back there as well, and that is a pumpkin charger that I got last year from the Target Dollar Spot. Here I just have the, the same tea towel. Like I said, it came in a pack of two. And then I have a little wreath that I always have up there. And I, this whole thing is from that blue. The chalkboard and everything is from Home Goods a few years back. So off of my kitchen, I need my outdoor patio area, just a little bit cozier. I've added some mums in here, the pumpkins. I didn't buy anything new for this area. I just used the extra decor that I had. I have a lot of fall decor. But most of the pumpkins, the mums are from Walmart. The pumpkins are either from Walmart or the Target dollar store that we've had for years. Um, this home sign is the one that I just re recently had on my front porch and that is from the tractor supply. And then our furniture is from um, Amazon. And so are the little poofs and lanterns are from our local grocery store um, during the summertime. Right here is an overview. I have a whole video on our outdoor area. If you would like to check that out, I'm just going to give you guys an overview. Oh, and those little jack-o'-lanterns, I've had those from Michael's. For Downstairs, we have my daughter's little play area. So I have um, a little, little burlap um, garland, and that is from Target this year, and it's Cats and Pumpkins. And then we have her little vignette here, so a Halloween book that we got from Home Goods, um, a tree with some figurines on it. The tree is from the Target Dollar Spot, the figurines are from the Dollar Tree. And then we have a little cauldron from the Target Dollar Spot this year, and then some pumpkins from the Target Dollar Spot this year. And her little table and chairs are from Amazon, and I will link those down below. And then over here we have this little Jacqueline on pillow, and that is from the um, Target Dollar Spot this year. And then as well as the tea towels, the Target Dollar Spot this year. And then up here we just have a book from Home Goods, and then a little Jacqueline that I'm pretty sure I got from CBS last year, and a little pumpkin from the Target Dollar Spot this year. And then the window cleans we got from Walmart this year. And then the little um, figurines, Halloween figurines, we picked those up from um, Target Dollar Spot this year. So that's her little area. And it's very festive for the season. And then our mantle. So our mantle, the mirror I got from Pier 1 years and years ago. The cotton stem reef. I picked up from Hobby Lobby one year when it was on major sale. So I got it for a few bucks, I think two years ago. The candle holders, I got those years and years ago from Pure One as well. Um, and then the houses, of course, are from Target um, Dollar Spot. The pumpkins, all of the orange ones are hand painted by me. They were really inexpensive white ones that I picked up from Walmart. And I just distressed them and um, made my own orange color that I wanted to use. 
this welcome sign. So I put it together because it says welcome home. That little sign I picked up from Walmart this year and the home sign is from the Target dollar spot a few years back. All of the greenery is Target dollar spot. And then these pumpkins are from um, the Dollar Tree and then the soft ones of course are from the Target dollar spot. But that's that little setup there and I absolutely love it. Oh, and our little topiaries, those are from Michael's. So for our living room area, I really didn't do anything crazy over here. Um, these are the pillows that we usually have. The fuzzy white ones um, are from Walmart. Last year, the gray ones came with the sofa. The white and teal colored ones are from the Hearth and Hand collection at Target. This lumber pillow is from Michael's during the summer. I got it for probably like five or six bucks. It was on a great deal. Um, my sofa is from Living Spaces. This uh, table, my husband made it. The greenery up there, that's from the Target dollar spot. Um, I'm going to say summertime. I added in some sprigs to make it a little bit more fallish from um, Walmart. And uh, I added the orange pump pumpkin, which actually lights up at night. That is from Target this year. I think it's the Threshold brand. And then the, a dollar store, um, little dollar, dollar Tree little pumpkin. And then that tin that everything is in, that is from Amazon. I want to say five or six years ago. And then we have this blanket ladder that is from Amazon. This year, I just have an assortment of blankets that we've had forever. I put a little wreath up there from Target and then a little Farm Fresh sign, and that is from um, the dollar store this year. And then over here, some people have those smart TVs. I mean, those um, TVs that the screen always has a picture on them. I just chose a screensaver from YouTube. So you can do this if guests are coming over. That's the rain that you hear, but you can do, you can mute it and not have it with the sound. But I thought it was really cute and gave that little fall cozy feel. And in this corner over here, we have these two tins and those are from Walmart a few years back. Um, the greenery that's usually always in it, um, that is from, the green stuff is from Target dollar spot, but I just threw in that little burnt orange color. That greenery is from Walmart. All of the pillows over here are from Walmart. My chair and the poof are from Amazon. The table is from Hobby, Lob Hobby Lobby this year. I think I got picked that for under 30. Um, the Homebody book, which is uh, Joanna Gaines. I love that book. It has helped me so much with decorating our home. And then there's one of those little bird cages that I picked up for a few bucks because they were on clearance at Michael's. And then I have some greenery in there from Target Dollar Spot this year. And then one of those velvet pumpkins from my local grocery store. It's that area. And then that sign is from Smallwood Goods. And downstairs we have the little bathroom and I didn't do much here. I just added some greenery from Walmart. I added that little dollar store, Dollar Tree pumpkin. And then that scent, I had it from last year. And the little tray underneath it is from the dollar, Target dollar spot a few years ago. So that's all I added for this area. And the vase that that's in, that was from the Target dollar spot um, a few years ago. In our little mud area, we just have this little pumpkin treat bag from um, Target Dollar Spot last year. And then I have this little Happy Fall Y'all bag from last year, one of our local pumpkin patches. And I have one of those like little witch rooms in here. And then over here, I have some, um, those little, placemats or whatever you want to call them from Hobby Lobby and then I have Fall in Love, this little pumpkin and some greenery from um, Hobby Lobby 
and then a little pumpkin from Hobby Lobby as well. Oh, the greenery I think is from Home Goods. So we have made it upstairs to my master bedroom. The kids' rooms, I didn't add any fall in there, I, and I just added little simple touches to our bedroom. So we have this candle here, this mercury candle that is actually from Aldi. I also picked up this Hello Pumpkin pillow. It's a pillow cover from Amazon, very affordable. I will have it link. And then on this cute little tray here, we just have all the other items I generally always have on there. Um, but I added, I put a candle that was gifted to me. These two little pumpkins from the Target Dollar Spot last year. And then that greenery piece is always there and that's also from Target. And this little light up greenery piece is from the Target Spot Dollar Spot this year. I added that for just a little bit of twinkle at night. And on my nightstand, I just have a tissue um, box cover that's gray that is from Amazon. I can link that down below and a book and just some florals from um, Jillian's. But my room, this um, kind of teal color is my favorite. I will also link, link my bedding. It is very, very affordable and it is from Amazon. But that is our master bedroom and it's just nice and cozy for fall. So didn't add much, but just those little touches make it just that much cozier. And then I love the little twinkling lights. I'm so excited. So at night we'll have a little, a little candlelight, a little twinkling light at nighttime. Um, this long, I don't even think you would call it a throw, but that is from Home Goods, same as the teal pillows, but everything else is from Amazon. So I will have that link for you guys. And I want to thank you guys so much for watching this video. I absolutely am obsessed with our home decorated for fall. You guys know I love all things seasonal, so I like to decorate for every single holiday. If you love that kind of content and love cleaning motivation, please don't hesitate to join my YouTube family. And I will also put my um, Instagram handle down in the comments below so you can follow me on there. But thank you again for watching and happy fall y'all. And I will see everybody at my next one. Bye.